YouTube don't demonetize me. I need to pay all of my rent. 15 seconds, I can swear. <coughs> oh my god. Cart Fiend 6. Yeah, you know what it is. It's your boy. I I woke up this morning. I was like, I'm a, I'm a field. The, I'm a feed the cult. I'm gonna feed the cult because y'all have been asking for this video for months, bro. Before we get into it, gotta do gotta do a, a, a little plugging tin, okay? Car banners are up on the website. Link in the description, okay? Bro, they're up for an additional 24 hours. I know I said 24 hours, but y'all like really fucking are buying these, so like you gotta capitalize on the opportunity. But uh, yeah. Without further fucking tin do, let's get right into it. Car fences, oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> And just for a little refresher, because I know it's been a while, some of y'all might be new to the series, um, I basically take your ideas of motherfuckers that hit the baba buoy, alright, and I start discussing the motherfuckers that hit the baba buoy. So first off, we got Fried Frodo. <laughs> I'm never doing that again. Fried Frodo always thinks he's on an adventure when he takes a blinker. I'm gonna keep it a buckington with you, bro. I am Fried Frodo, bro, because when I hit the motherfucking cart gym in, bro, and I, like, do some medial tasks, bro, like, say, say I'm in Walmart, right? And I'm absolutely getting fried in Walmart. That shit turned into a whole goddamn side quest, bro. Like, like, say, say, per chance, I'm there to get toilet paper, right? But I'm fried, bro. Motherfucker, I'm in Fallout 4. Like, that, the mini map pops up, bro. Like, the whole heads up display, bro. I got a Pip Boy gym in that bitch. Next up, we got Clogged Carter. Always has a cart, but it's clogged and takes forever to unclog. To be honest, bro, like, I feel for Clogged Carter. This shit is a tragedy when it happens, bro. And, like, no ditty, bro, but you, you really, you really gotta suck on that shit to get it unclogged. Hey, yo! What the fuck? Nah, but for real, like, this shit really tragic. New paddock, hop out the via, get static, bro. Because I'm gonna be honest with you, bro. I've had a cart one time that clogged after almost every single hit, bro. And, like, I wouldn't wish it on my worst enemy. That shit is absolutely useless, Jimin, when it's clogged. Next up, we got ra Racketeering Requise. This motherfucker hits the pen Penjaminington and immediately wants to do the most devious shit ever. I've encountered a couple racketeering requises and like, to be honest, bro, like, you would've thought these motherfuckers took Fent, bro, the way they be moving. Like, real shit, bro, maybe I just wanna hit the cart and I don't wanna complete a fully fledged, thought through, planned out diamond store heist. You know what I mean? Next up, we got White Noise Walter. <laughs> This man always yapping but never says nothing. The only guy that everyone can simultaneously tune out and not say shut the fuck up. To be honest, bro, I'm, I'm a little babbler, bro. Okay, when I get fried, bro, I be babbling about nothing. So I think... Is this me, bro? Am I am I fucking cook chat? Like, like, am I actually like in the top one percent of yappers? Because I've made an entire career about yapping. Like, my job is to fucking yap. So I feel like I am White Noise Walter. We interrupt your scheduled split pro programming to to show you my my other channels. We got more split, uh, featuring amazing videos such as. My dad shows me a random generator he found and then has a minor argument with his girlfriend. Go sign by Tay Sonday. Or my third channel where I upload my music. Because I make music. That's why I'm able to sing really good in the intros. So I'm waiting for everyone to put two and two together so I can blow up as an artist. Uh, back to your scheduled split programming. Next up, we got Packaging Patrick. Every time you get a new cart, he asks for your packaging and collects them for examination and admiration. <laughs> I've definitely ran across a couple rare Pokemon such as Packaging Patrick, alright? They're like fucking, what's the guy from Lord of the Rings? A little slimy guy, dude, and he likes shiny things, dude. The, it's like that, bro, but instead of shiny things, it's it's cartridge packaging. And this motherfucker intakes a lot of information, bro. You just be at the session, he'll be like, Did you know that the Grape Ape strain actually consists of 14.6% THC, 82.7% CBD? I really think that it is essential to have a packaging Patrick whenever you're in the circle, bro, because one, you're gonna get a lot of information on what you're smoking, and two, like, you can ask this motherfucker about anything. But I wanna know, what are y'all guys' cart fiends that you've encountered out in the wild, bro. Out in the wasteland, bro. Drop them down in the comments or the Split Homework channel in the Discord. Speaking of Split Homework, you already know what time it is. It's your boy.
Okay, dude, I'm sorry. I'm, like, really energized right now. I drank a Red Bull before I recorded this, so I'm geeking, I'm tweaking, I can't save no hoe. I want you to put in the Discord channel, what cart are you smoking on right now? I want to see some buffoonery, bro. I want to see the Mario carts, bro. I want to see the Timu carts. I want to see some wild shit. And, also, if you're not in the Discord, you should join that shit, because once I see the motherfucking carts that y'all got, we're gonna do a motherfucking analysis, okay? I'ma hop in that bitch with y'all, in the voice channel, in the 24-7 smoke sesh. Gotta be 18 to join that motherfucker, though, because of governmental laws. We will go over the carts as a cult, and we will judge them, and we will rate the homework, bro. I know y'all have been asking me to rate the homework for a long fucking time, dude, and it's gonna happen, okay? So make sure you're in the Discord, make sure you got the noties turned on for that shit, make sure you got the noties turn on for the channel all the youtuber shit you feel me it is what it is also i wanted to thank you guys so much for the support on the minecraft video i actually really loved making that and we are going to be doing a full playthrough uh you guys have absolutely peer pressured me into making this a series so we will be completing the entire fucking game all the way to the ender dragon bro it's, go it's probably going to take a long time dude because i'm dog shit but you know what I mean? Other than that, I just wanted to say I love you guys so much. Don't die. For the outro, I'm going to play one of my songs because some one of y'all in the Discord gave me that great idea. And I was like, damn, dude, that is that is an absolutely slapping idea. So, yeah, love you guys so much. Take care. Don't die. Come here. Give me a little kiss on the mouth. Mm -mm -mm. All right, bro, dude, I'm going to stop. You need to go to jail. No Diddy. What's good, son? I just came back from one of Diddy's parties. There was dick and balls everywhere. Okay, dude, I'm going to stop. <laughs> Till I OD, I kill my liver uh, Gun slides, never show to all my pistol Gotta take another line so I don't fucking miss I fuck a bitch, you vanilla So I turn into a killer, it's gonna backfire on me If everyone's split Personality, borderline, but I don't give a shit If I hurt you, that's my mission Don't give a fuck about my image Don't give a fuck how I'm living These bitches have made me a little upset So I stuck in a motherfucking kitchen Locked in the studio, 24 hours I did not send us was written Too many people concerned about my health I'm concerned about my nerves been itching But still upset, famous and deeper dead No one's coming to collect Like no one's coming to connect Emotions are rather less devotion I can't correct But who needs love and honesty When you got trust, you cancel it I'd rather be on myself at the least be somebody that I cannot respect I could OD off the blow with no one around to feel my chest But if I do decide to go Who be there to sign my chest? Keep my feelings on the low So I don't make my family sad Just smile for the camera so you can ice your wrist But when that light goes out You wanna slice your wrist They'll never understand How I you fight for this They'll never understand How I you try for it